morning, happy Tuesday. I got up way too early this morning because I thought that I needed to leave the house. Well, I do need to leave the house in five minutes. But for some reason I thought it would take me 45 minutes to like drink a coffee and get ready. And of course that took me two minutes. So I've just been laying around, which has been nice. I watched a couple vlogs in the morning, which was a nice change of pace to watch them in the morning. It's instead of a pres Oh my god, I can't speak. To watch them in the morning instead of a procrastination tool. But today I have an exciting day, so I'm looking forward to it. I am heading out to go to Soul Cycle with my friend Iris. I have a beef with Class Pass. I mean, everybody has this beef, but I've been feeling it particularly more acutely. I love Class Pass. And Class Pass, if you want to sponsor me, which you definitely don't, please sponsor me. But let me tell you, let me give you some Class Pass math. I am on the 23 credit plan, which is like not cheap. It's $49 a month. I don't know why I'm showing you guys this, obviously. You could just look this up. It's $49 a month. I used to have a discount on this through work. Now I don't. I wonder if there's a student discount. There's probably not. 23 credits a month. Okay, that used to get me like three-ish classes a month, which I feel like is fine. You know, it's New York. Classes are expensive. It's fine. Yoga classes are usually like six credits and then something more mainstream like berries or something would be 12 credits or something. So I was looking at this soul cycle class to book for this morning to go with my friend. And oh my gosh, class pass is becoming like flights. If you take a look at the class and then you don't book it, you know what they do, they increase the price of the class. So I took a look at it and it was 17 credits, which is crazy. I mean, I'm going at a super popular time. I definitely get it, you know, and they're doing all the right things. I, I respect their hustle. I didn't book it because I was like, that's crazy. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't book it. I should have known to book it. And then I went back to book it later in the night, of course, closer to the deadline. And it was 18 credits. So I'm basically using like all of the credits for my month on this one soul cycle class. So this better be the best soul cycle class I've ever been to. Because that's like the equivalent of 30 bucks, which is what a soul cycle class costs, but you're supposed to get a discount with Class Pass, and now I'm just fully not getting that discount. So anyway. I'm excited for the class. I haven't been in a while, but yeah. After that, I just have class today, so I'm gonna go to school and then just bop around. I'm gonna see one of my friends. I think I'm gonna cook a good meal. So I think it'll be a good day to vlog. So let's get after it. This is cute, I was so early getting up and now I'm running late, so here we go. friend who won't be on camera but she said I could film her body. <laughs> uh, Soul Cycle was really great. How many stars would you give Soul Cycle? Five. Five. Marvin was awesome. Yeah, Marvin was awesome. Now I'm heading to class saying goodbye to anonymous girl. Goodbye. One, two, three. <laughs> Just got coffee with another camera shy friend. Now I am gonna go over to Trader Joe's, get some groceries, and make my way back home. I decided to take the ferry and I was watching Hannah Elise's vlog earlier this morning and I remembered she went from here to the one hotel in Brooklyn Bridge Park, which is like such an inconvenient location to get to, but is pretty easy on the ferry. 
and you can do work there for free. So I thought I might as well just go there. The stuff I bought is like pretty not perishable and the ferry's coming. So I think this is a beautiful plan. So I'm just gonna get on the boat and then go over there and try to do a little work and then maybe go home. But here it comes. I can see it rolling in. Okay, just got back from the one hotel. That was a super nice experience. Definitely would recommend if you need a place to work and it's free, the Wi-Fi is super fast and you don't have to ask for a password or anything, which is really nice. I am going to, well, actually it's like 5.11. I want to cook a little bit of dinner. I have a Zoom meeting from six to seven, so annoying. So I'm probably gonna cook and like let it sit and then do my meeting and then eat dinner after that. So I wanna get that started. This is not a cooking channel, so I don't feel like showing my cooking process, but I'm making a super easy recipe. I'll link it here. It's basically like a butter chicken variant, but instead of chicken, it's chickpeas and tofu, which is nice because you don't have to like deal with the chicken and everything. So I'm just going to cook that up. It's super simple and then make some rice on the side. Um, but let's just do a quick grocery haul. Just got some coconut milk for this evening and also some tomatoes for this evening. I got Brussels sprouts. I'm just going to eat these a different day. I have another recipe in mind for that firm tofu, two things of frozen broccoli. I like to just keep that on hand in case I need to eat something in the lemon. And that is all I got. And that came to $15.13. So not bad in this economy. <laughs> I'm just gonna put that away and then start cooking. One hack I have is if you have an onion that's about to go bad, I just cut it up and freeze it. So that's what I'm gonna use tonight instead of just a regular onion. Comment from one of my many YouTube accounts that don't have my name in it saying, where's that Matt character? I miss him. <laughs> walking through Park Slope because it's beautiful out. And we're gonna go to Simple Loaf to get something to eat. I'm excited for the food. I think forgot my drink order, so it makes me worry about her. <laughs> Uh, if it's good to come. 